Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Live from the rising sun, the land of our infinite creator. I bless each and every one of you as the sun rises, the golden beam of light covers the entire globe. I thank the creator of all that gives me the courage and the strength to go on in this fight. The divine program, the final battle of the Titans, Itanimuli versus Illuminati. Yesterday, January 28, the world witnessed those people that defied the divine law were in the gathered as they thought they can still overrule the law of the sovereignty the law that will give them the final mandate as we recover the holy asset used and abused by the political leaders of this world i as queen of the universal magnum the queen of the global earth the queen of the mother nature as given by our seven magdum by our creator i stand tall to all the world as I have said, not mine to lose, but yours. Yesterday is the showcase of the finality of the power, the claimants fight. You lose, I win for the poor it is a consolidation of all those classified price the lord drug lords gambling lords lord of lords of all the suppressors and oppressors of this land of promise as i call our majority people today stand for the rights of your family, for your own rights to live in peace, in harmony, without any fear that those praise the Lord, gambling lords, casinos, pogo, all of those will dominate and saturize your brain that they are the good leaders of this land. Motherland, why no more? The freedom is given to you. The freedom to live. The freedom to walk in the valleys without fear. The freedom against hunger and poverty the freedom of all those that has been incarcerated because of mistaken identity because of the suppression and the oppression of the judges that mistakenly giving you the verdict i am asking all the highest court to give justice 
and to you our little president of the Federal Republic of the Philippine Islands. Act now as you are appointed. I have already made my mandate and you have to adhere that. The recovery of all the assets, of all the properties of God is already given last December 15, 2023, when I was in Manila. The global reset has been given to you. Thank you for all the leaders of the United Nations, of the International Court of Justice, of the International Court, Criminal Court, for adhering to my call to impose the rule of law. You are appointed not only by the leaders of each nation, but by God himself, by Allah. As I talk to you with my heart, filled with the illumination of the light coming from the golden sun, I ask you now, arrest all the culprit that had given the light to the wrong path, light versus light, but the light from heavens, the light from the golden sun, the light from the creator is the winner of all. The battle of the titans, the battle of the recovery of souls from the grip of Lucifer is now the start of the divine judgment. Thank you, our forefathers, our ancient ancestors who prepared me to face this battle. I call for you, my leaders, and thank you for not joining the battle of the beast yesterday. This is the moment that you should see that I am not what they thought. I am the queen of light. It is not anymore your problem. This is the problem of the divinity on how to recover each soul that had been covered by the dark side. You yourself can witness. You can see how they acted. Actors, actresses, been joining together to mislead the entire population of this country. They have not anticipated that I always watch in every channel that they are passing through. The light will always illumine the darkest side because I know in every streak of light, God, Allah, is there. They are my armors. They are always part and parcel of every breath that I take in my saga, in my crusade, to put divine justice. Helen, as they say, is just a minute being to combat them because they have played gods. They have played the creator themselves that had defied the divine law. As I call the entire world, come now. You have no money. The global reset had been imposed. Europe banking system collapsed. China 
you are just trying to keep among yourselves the suffering of the entire global system. But as I put up the global resolution, I know that you shall see the golden age, the golden sun, the golden light that had been there all along to guide our path towards peace and prosperity that the Lord, that Allah had prepared for all of us. I know this is not me who would like really to recover his soul, but God, the creator himself. Lucifer lose, God, Allah wins. But you people that had been living in darkest of all the dark, come to the light. Let us lead our people towards the light. As I face the golden sun, my wish and my need now is come to light. Illuminati had failed to put that light. We must stand now for the new generation. We must take this as a challenge. The new government of the world is not the one that you have in mind fixated the people. You owed God, you owed Allah for your life is nothing without him who created you. Never again play the gods, never again suppressed and oppressed the people because he rules now. Let him cover you with the light that he envisioned for you to live in peace in prosperity. I call my leaders to come out into the open and serve the majority poor that had been enslaved by the Illuminatis. I have surfaced and come out again and again to remind humanity that the Creator is recovering you. My project is the final battle of the Titans, Itanimuli versus Illuminati. Through M.M. Rab, which I have envisioned and predicted to fight against the bomb. Millennium M.A. 23 Rehabilitation Bureau will be the one to topple down the Bangsamoro Autonomous Region of Muslim Mindanao wherein they have used and abused that power loaned to them. I am using the Papu versus the Opap that had been their entity to make the people believe that they are doing it for peace and prosperity. I have reversed the same, the Opapru, and now it's called Orpapu, where in the United Royal Philippines, against police oppression, where in yesterday you abused that power. I dissolved the Philippine National Police, the military, and you are not the people that are entitled to protect our rights. Instead, you allowed yourself to be used and controlled by the Illuminati leaders of Malacanang, of the Supreme Court, of the Senate, of the Congress, of the governors, 
of the mayors in the barangays. I am giving you the finality. You cannot beat the world of peace as governed by the divinity, the owner of the land, the owner of the air, the owner of fire, the owner of the soil, and all the mountains and valleys, the creation of God. You have no more power over that. It is with the power of the new government, of the new rule of law, wherein the light dominates the entire world. This is Queen Helen, the Queen of Light. Helen the torch, Helen that will give light. It is not yours to judge. It is God's ways, not yours. I stand before the sun who gives me the power and strength and courage to really speak out into the world. Come out now. Don't be covered by darkness, but be with the light. The light that will give you the golden path towards the heavens, towards the rule of the divine being. I know I am now what you call very historical because I am calling not only the Filipinos, not only the Maharlikans, not only the indigenous people of our motherland, but the entire global earth. Stand for your family. Stand for yourself. Go back to the creator who has created you. It is now the power of light that will topple down the Illuminatis who had controlled us since time immemorial. My voice echoes the entire global earth because I know I am mandated to say this again to you. You have no more power. Return that power to God, to Allah. I, I speak out again this voice lead you to the holy path of the golden light, of the light that will save us all. God, Allah himself. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Masalam.